Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat plague. Yes, yes. The pressure was too low. All these new machines are touchy. Just don't do anything crazy. Sokolov's changed everything, and we don't know what the hydraulics can do. Hello, sir. We got him here today doing a portrait. Corvo, you're back! Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait! Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. Did you see any monsters while traveling to the other isles? My nanny says the big ocean's full of them. But I think she only says that to scare me. Run with me! While you were gone, Mother seemed very sad. Let's see if you're still good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. We should go now, so Mother can see you too. Uh. Well, 
Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. She'll see you at once. <coughs> They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo! Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. What news Follow have me, you brought? Captain. We should leave them alone. I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before, knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards! They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! Thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Oh. 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 Mommy! Oh. Get away! Corvo! Corvo! It's all coming apart. Fine. Find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. Chance, Corvo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. 
Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed. But it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now. Someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this. Even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time. And someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corvo. Guards! Take him back to his cell. You should eat, Corvo. His meal comes from a friend. the execution tomorrow. It's on account of Corvo, the one who killed the Empress and abducted her daughter, Emily. So it's an occasion. Right. A social event for the High and Mighty. Come see the noble Lord Protector get his head chopped off. You're as bad as us betting on the dogfights. Attention. The solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort. Solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Again, what you'll do if Slack John is Bottle Street Boys jumping. Blow off.
get him. There's two of them. Dignitaries only. I know you're here. Call out if you see him. He's slippery. Check everything. scheduled in advance with one week's notice.
slug? Did you patrol the yard? Sorry, not yet. I was gonna report that boiler leak from yesterday. Forget it. Just do your rounds. The report's trouble for both of us. I'm moving. Huh? Ah! Assassin, help! Take! Let's feed him to the house! <laughs> Attention. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. Tomorrow's execution is tomorrow, right? Yeah, but everything has to be set up today. I can't wait to see his hand work. Not everyone did, but I really like the Empress. Did you hear Morris was dragged off by the Overseers? Or some black magic nonsense? You always amuse me.
I hope we'll find out who did that, or we're all dead. Let's just see what happens if I get another crack at this guy. Kill the Empress. You don't care about a few guards. Shut up. Look at this stuff. Somebody's been down here. Bottle Street gang, maybe. Watch for booby traps. Could be some down here by the look of it. Good. If we're lucky, one of them will get Corvo. You're afraid of him? All merchants and whores down there. Kids like you, you never saw him. Like. I saw him fight three to one in the practice yard. I hope it's me that finds him. I hope it is too.
were supposed to load the bodies into carts headed to the flooded district? Yeah, but screw that. That's too far. I don't want to catch the plague, do you? No. Doesn't the elixir prevent it? Maybe. Either way, let's just dump them down there. The rats eat them.
won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take them out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make a lot of noise when you die. Knock something over if you can. Bastard. Smells like a dead leaper in here. I'm here to die sometimes in the dark. Just slip into the water, don't come out. I wonder how deep <laughs> you Assassin! Help! You're gonna...
Assassin Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair Empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. Several brave officers of the state are dead by his hand. He is to be captured or killed at any cost. Over here! Quickly! I'm a friend! I'm Samuel. And I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here, but I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Closed for business, half the district marked off as dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the Loyalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can.
Attention all citizens. Curfew extends from sundown to sunrise unless you are otherwise authorized. Violators will be subject to interrogation and detained when necessary. Remember, the boldest men... My, you must be Corvo. I am Lydia, at your service. Your room is upstairs and ready. When they told me who it was, well, I thought you'd be older, like the Admiral. I expect they're hard at work in there. Best join them. They'll help you get whoever really killed the Empress. So it's starting at last, Admiral. We found our man. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. 
until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes, Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Infectious contact. Violators will be taken to the flooded district for treatment and rehabilitation. Good. Have you talked to Piero yet? He made the weapons we left for you on your way out of Colbridge Bridge. Go see him. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. No! This cannot happen now. The tank of whale oil is running. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. Oil's unstable. When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. Perfect. Now plug it in. Perfect. Thank you, Corey. Here, see? The Assassin's Mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? Lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you.
be exhausting. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Very well. You know best. Let me know if you need anything more. My break with the Academy was explosive, for lack of a better word. I had to rebuild from scratch, but so much the better. I was sick of using tools made by lesser men. You've met Piero. Good. You'll want to get some rest now. You'll be needed soon. Do not attempt to house or care for a friend or family member who shows signs of blood on their face and chest area. The only way to help them is to bring them to the city watch. They will be taken to the flooded district for treatment.
Attention Dunwall citizens. Be advised, the river crust infestation has spread downriver as far yes, as the river very mouth much so, and flooded. No need to fear. Do not attempt to, to approach or destroy a river crust. Who we'll say he killed the Empress? Any of course he didn't. From doing so People are, are foolish and believe property. whatever they're told. Okay. If the Admiral trusts him, then so will I. My furnishings have been installed at last with no small amount of complaining by that antiquated boatman. The others have no idea what it's like to suffer as I have. Speaking of which... Wallace, please breathe two bottles of Dunwall Red, never mind which. Fetch a clean glass. Lady Emily Caldwin was abducted six months ago during her mother's terrible murder. Anyone with information leading to the location or return of the daughter of our beloved late Empress is required to speak to the City Watch at once. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead, 
Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you and drawn you into the void. I am the outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that men call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Come find me.
days that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. What I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest.
Should I clear a space for Samuel then? If you like, but he won't use it. Why? He can't sleep in regular beds anymore, or that's what he says. Says he was in the Navy too long. Can you believe it? Oh. That pile of wood out there? It's a hobble he built from an old rowboat. Where does Admiral Havelock find these people, I wonder? Attention Dunwall citizens, be advised, the river crust infestation has spread downriver, as far as the river mouth and flooded district. Do not attempt to approach or destroy a river crust. Any items recovered from doing so are considered state property. Let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business, but sometimes good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Campbell dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us, and if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the Howe Pits.
Attention Dunwall citizens. Do not attempt to house or care for a friend or family member who shows signs of blood on their face and chest area. The only way to help them is to bring them to the city watch. They will be taken to the flooded district for treatment. Oh, Corvo? If you've a moment... Corvo. Hello. I'm Callista. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer. That wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me. But my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison, and I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Before you became an assassin. Just wondering, sir, if you thought about perhaps seeing Piero before venturing into the Overseer's Nest? I'd recommend going with the best gear you can get together. Ready to go? Just give the signal. straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague, the other half's fighting over what's left. City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. And there are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. Know which is worse. Just take your pick.
Attention, Dunwall citizens. John Clavering Boulevard has been designated a restricted travel area. Any citizens are liable to search or imprisonment at the discretion of the city watch. Dunwall citizens, this is a special announcement from our Honorable Lord Regent. This is the Lord Regent speaking. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest and potentially beyond. In addition, in this continuing crisis, the overseers of the Abbey of the Everyman remain in service to the state and our
find you, you hagfish. You gotta be here somewhere. Yeah, I'll flush nothing. you out. I know you're here. Crazy? They can hear anything you say. Can't hear him forever. I know you're somewhere around here. Oh, I'll find you. Scrubbing. You're unclean. Unclean? That's nonsense. Can we just... No, 